This video is brought to you by Squarespace.com. What's up everybody, this is Danny, and I had an opportunity to check out Moto's gamepad a little early, and while there are a ton of mods available and there's new ones coming, this one really caught my eye, so I wanted to spend as much time as I could with it. It was actually announced earlier this year, then just fell off the face of the map, and all of a sudden now we have a full production model at the Z2 Force event. So here are my thoughts. I really enjoy my Nintendo Switch, so naturally the gamepad kind of reminds me of this, but of course it's not going to have the same impact, and we'll get into that later. Let's talk about what makes this gamepad special, and the first thing is that this is a physical connection and not a Bluetooth one, so you do not have to worry about input lag when playing your games. The gamepad itself is long, and it mostly feels like you're holding a Nintendo Switch in your hand, but lighter of course. I feel that all the buttons that you need are here. You have dual analog sticks, directional pad, A, B, X, and Y, start select, and shoulder buttons that light up at the top, which is a nice touch. And on the back you get this glowing logo that represents Lenovo's gaming efforts. And while it doesn't add anything, I think it looks pretty cool, but damn is that logo big. This has a built-in 1035 milliamp hour battery, so it won't suck up your phone's battery on long gaming sessions, which I think is critical, and it's rechargeable by USB-C, and it gives you back the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, which I also think is a nice touch since the recent Z-series phones do not have headphone jacks. Ergonomically, I think it feels a little long, but when I played real racing on this, it felt really good. The analog sticks felt responsive, and games like this are just so much better with physical controls. I thought the buttons felt a little cheap though, a little hollow, but until I use this long term, it'll be hard to tell if that will hurt the gaming experience. There's good texture to the back, and the gamepad felt pretty solid and had plenty of grip, so that's good. If you have a Moto Z series phone and you're into gaming, then I think this could be the mod for you to get. Now, me personally, I can't wait to get this because I'm an emulator fan, I'm an old school gaming dude, so this layout and feel, I think it's gonna be perfect for emulators. Now, I think this could be a game-changing thing for people that own Moto Z series phones that are gaming purists, but I wish that this was a universal attachment for all phones, a physical connection, and I think that's why this can't be Android's Nintendo Switch. This actually makes me wish that Nvidia would just come out with a Shield Portable 2. Another barrier that I see is that this thing's gonna launch for $80 at the end of August, and there's a lot of Bluetooth gaming peripherals and controllers out there that are probably half the price. Now, they're not physical connections, but they work. So Moto Z owners are gonna have to think about if this is worth it or not. Now, what I would suggest is wait for this thing to launch, maybe wait for the holidays, wait until this thing goes on sale, and then scoop it up for a smaller price, because $80 is a little bit high. Of course, I'm gonna follow up when I get this thing, so if you have any questions about it, make sure you leave the comments in the comment section below, and I'll answer those questions when I get this thing. Make sure you smash the like button if you enjoyed this, and also subscribe if you feel like being awesome, and I will see you guys in the next video. It doesn't matter if you own a restaurant, have a little small online store, or if you wanna start the next big vlog, squarespace.com is an all-in-one solution that will help you build a website fast and easy. You don't need to learn how to code, and if you don't know what you're doing, that's okay. Just pick from one of these beautiful templates, and it's basically just drag and drop from there. Squarespace maintains it all, so you don't have to worry about it, and they have 24-7 customer service, so if you need a website, give it a try and use squarespace.com slash Danny and get 10% off today.